three zucchinis and I heard the other day that you can peel these bad boys, de-seed them, shred them, I'm gonna shred them in my food processor and then dehydrate them to make, well and then after that you would put them in a the food processor and just make powder of it. So it would be a zucchini flour which would be a low carb flour. And I guess you can make like breads and things like that. So because I do the Trim Healthy Mama Diet Plan, um, that would totally be an FP. If you know what that is, you could also make it into an E or an S meal um, or bread type. Anyway, I'm super excited. Like I could make pizza dough and bread and muffins and all sorts of things from this if, if it works. So let's go through the process and see how it works and if it works. Okay, we filled up our first bucket of shredded zucchini. So now what I'm gonna do is bring my Nesco food dehydrator over. And I don't know what's gonna be better. So I don't know, we're gonna try every other one. This one is see-through or like holy, I guess. And this is solid. Thank you, Lacey. So we'll do every other one. So I'll just start building it right here. And they said um, to, you know, to spread it out as much as you can so it gets as dry as possible. I'm very interested to see how this, like the texture, how it's all gonna turn out. I don't know. So we got all six trays of our food dehydrator filled up. Every other one is the holy, on the holy sheet um, things and the other ones are the solids. So I'm gonna put the lid on it. And it's already, let's see, vegetables and fruits 135. So we're got it up to the dial on 135. And I'm just gonna pop this in and check it in probably 12 hours. So it is 3.30 now. Maybe not quite 12 hours. <laughs> I'll check it tomorrow morning. Um, so we'll let that get going. Um, there's about two cups left of shredded zucchini. And so we're probably gonna make up a batch of zucchini bread, zucchini muffins, something like that. And then I wanted to tell you, one thing I love about chickens is that all of our food scraps like this, so this is the peelings and the seeds of the um, zucchini, um, we get to feed to our chickens and they just love it. They love these treats. And so we actually have a, a bucket here in the kitchen that we just fill up that kind of stuff. So, and then we'll take it out to them. So I'm gonna go take this out with the chickens. I'm gonna let this run its course. So I just took the six layers of um, my food dehydrator and peeled off all the shredded zucchini, put it in my um, container. Let's see, it gave me about, I'd say seven cups worth. So I'm gonna put the lid on that and bring it over. Um, whiz it up and see if we could get flour out of this. So here's the final product. It's um, slightly clumpy, but I think it can break apart mostly. I'm kind of wondering if this was what was in the bottom because here's a little bit of a shaving. Um, I think it would be good enough at least for my baking there you see there are some but overall it's very flaky so I'm gonna try it as a flower this ended up giving me right at three quarters of a cup so six trays of the dehydrator full of shredded um zucchini turned into uh, three quarters of a cup of flour. So not sure it would be worth it for me to do this in the future unless I just have a major abundance of zucchini. But in the meantime, it's good to know 
you can make this if you need to or if you have a whole whole bunch I know I don't the other um the other thing is it took quite a long time um, for it to get dehydrated and really fully dried out and even this I mean it's been a week probably since I started it all right have a great day Thank you.